What's up, everybody? I'm your host, Brian Watkins, and welcome to another edition of the Brian Watkins Channel. My subject today is games that women play. The reason why I'm making this video, for those of my viewers, it can relate to this subject. Let's get started. Shout outs to all of my viewers for liking, sharing, commenting, subscribing, supporting and donating my channel. I said it before and I'll say it again. But without you, I am nothing. Be on the lookout for more live streaming. My super chat, my clothing line, and more platforms to expand the Brian Watkins channel. Hit that subscribe button for two reasons. I make videos constantly and you have a chance to win cash. To my new viewers, welcome. Hit that subscribe button for the same thing, same outcome. And don't forget to smash that like button. So let's get started. Here's what I'm noticing. We live in the 21st century, right? Right. I'm noticing that women are knowingly continuing to play 20 20th century, 20th century games in the 21st century. Now, thanks to the internet, it gives us as men infinite options to meet conversate with other women now fellas wouldn't it be logical and intelligent for women to step up their game but a lot of them haven't and they won't and then they get upset with you when you're like well hey okay well goodbye they get mad. Especially if you turned around and spent a little money. You know, fellas, us as men, no matter how handsome you look, no matter how good you dress, no matter how nice your conversation is, or what type of car you're driving, or what you're doing for a living, you know to get a woman's attention, you got to spend some money, right? Take her out, eat, movie. Or for those who want to maybe take on a trip with you. I'm saying that to say this. Once a man has did that, he has passed the woman's test. Right? Right. But what she do to you? She still take you for granted. Still disrespect you. You still have been taught after being mistreated for nothing you have not said or did. Not to trust her. No. No. She still want to dog you. And it's really sad that they still want to play uh, 20th century games in the 21st century. So I don't feel bad for women today that men don't want to marry them. I don't feel bad for women today when a man don't want to get engaged to a woman. I don't feel bad when a man don't want to have a relationship with a woman after she has shown him that she is somebody that should not be trusted. And I'm also glad that us as men just decided to walk away. You know, you chop up your losses. You're much wiser than you were for the next one. It's probably going to run you through some more bullshit. It's fucked up. Like I said about them uh, losing work at GM or uh, because of uh, automation, Agenda 21. It's coming more and more on the scene. Women don't have money like they have. And they never will ever again. And they still want to play stupid motherfucking ass games. See, us as men, we're logical. We know that if we even try any of that stuff with a woman, your ass is history, right? Right. Whether you got the money or not, you got to still match their timing. Or your ass is shit out of luck. And it's really sad, you know, that 
men are more and more going me time. You know, you learn to listen with a more even selective ear with them. You know, I admit, I, I prefer to be platonic friends with a woman for as long as possible. Why? So that I'm able to gain her trust in that matter. So that maybe maybe we can build a friendship. Uh, so far, I've been failing at it because they get upset when you see through their bullshit and you nice about it. And you, you know, want to keep it platonic or you just go on and leave them alone. Now they get mad. But um, I like being their friends so that if I ever make it there, so that I can see that if she meet other guys and she tell me about it, I want to see how she going to treat them. So that way, if she decide to try to flip the script and ignore that we platonic friends and try to run some shit on me. And come with the pussy to try to get some money in a squirmish, evil, skanky, scamming way. I already know her patterns on how she deal with guys. So that's the benefit about being a platonic friend with the woman. Is to see how she treat those new guys with you being her platonic friend. And when they find out that that's my intentions with some women that know how I am. They still get mad talking about something. I'm being wrong. I'm being shady. I'm being misleading. I'm being cunning. I'm being deceptive. No. I'm just staying true to the game. You stay true to the game, the game will stay true to you. So, fellas, put it down in my uh, comment section. On, you know, how do you feel about this? I definitely want to know. And uh, those of you who want to make a donation to su continue to support the Brian Watkins channel, it's uh, well appreciated. And uh, you can look at my link in the description section and you can do that. Thank you. Don't you go anywhere.